Hello, welcome to my channel. So I'll be doing the CME 1500 Naira challenge. So I'm going to show me the video and uh, showing us how to use 1500 Naira to make a meal for her family. And she encouraged other YouTubers to do the same. So today I decided to make mine. And I decided to make soup. <laughs> Why I decided to make soup was that uh, a while ago, somebody told me, ah, I like people's soups, but they're really expensive. And I said, what do you mean by expensive? I, d I don't see them as ex expensive. And so, like, ah, I'm just saying that because uh, it's just something I grew up with and all that. So this would be a good opportunity to see if I can, <laughs> if we can really make something nice with a little amount of money. Here is my list. I have uh, my list here. Everything is about a thousand four hundred. I'll see how far it goes. It's about raining. I hope this rain will just hold it until I go to the market and come back. And I hope I can get some footage for you guys to see. I'm not to see me is a Nigerian food and lifestyle blogger, stroke vlogger. I've known her for years, or I have followed her for years. How I got to know about her was that I somehow stumbled on her article that she wrote. You remember when Steve Harvey made a mistake of announcing the wrong Miss Universe? Yes, that was the article I saw of her, of hers, and I read it, and I liked what I read. From there, I think there was a link to her YouTube channel. I saw like a vlog, and since then, I've been following her. So I watched her video some days ago, encouraging us to make this. I decided to jump on it and make mine. Let's see what I can buy in Abuja, Nigeria. I'm going to Karo Market in Abuja. I think that is also going to have an impact on my results because I know if I were to go to Wuse Market, things would be more expensive than they are in Karo Market. So let's go along, hoping the rain will allow us. What are they? How much? Yeah, eight hundred. No, no, I did Okay, like this one I have one. Four hundred. Okay. This one five hundred. But I don't want plenty like this. So. Mm. You know uh, what I want like this? Yes. You know, my money don't go rich. I want you small. Two hundred. If you get one fifty, you uh, uh, hey, put one fifty for me. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. That's so that cut now. Fifty fifty naira. No hundred. Hundred. Ah, okay. <laughs> Ma, put it with 150. Yes, 150. Ah, okay. Mm, thank you. I want meat 400. But make it plenty. I know, give me bone. You get 20 naira onions. Yes. Give me. How many you go give me for 20 naira? Ah, uh, why you could give me only one now? <laughs> Sure you get it. My 15 I get it. My 15 I get it. Yeah. I send you the one. Ah. Your favorite is sell Maggie. You will collect it. Why 13 I get 20 You give me two for 13 I don't need up two, but give me, no problem. Okay. You give me two. That's two hundred. Mm -hmm. What I leave? How much? One fifty. You know get hundred naira on. This one. And this one go do now. So you give me. I know we cut them, so you just wrap up for me. Thank you. What small one? I'm on a very limited budget. 100 naira. Yes, 100 naira. You have? Okay. 100 naira. 100 naira. Stop. Stop. Okay. You don't have 20 naira. So if I have 20 I cannot buy Maggie in the market. <laughs> eh? 
So guys, here are the things I bought. This is unbelievable. This meat is 400 naira. I'm not too happy about the meat, but hey, it's still meat. This is crayfish. It's 50 naira. I, the guy actually told me the 50 naira crayfish would be small, but I just said I beg, I beg. Put it like that for me. I just didn't want to exceed the budget. This is for more. He's so small. This is my promo for 100 naira. This is my yellow pepper. I just figured if I had to get just one type of pepper, let me get this yellow pepper. This is 50 naira. The garri is 100 naira. Stockfish, Oporoko. This is 100 naira. This is onion for 30 naira. I didn't even know they could give you 30 naira onions. You guys saw it in the earlier clip. This is the onion. This is 30 naira. Palm oil. This is 150. <laughs> My seasoning cube. This is 15 naira. They refuse selling anything less than that. And then my ugu. My econ. This is 100 naira. So I got two. You guys saw them earlier. And the water leaf. The water leaf is so much for 100 naira. I think it's because of the rainy season. So it's in abundance. That's why. It is so much. So everything here is 1,330 naira. I actually wanted to get Umfi, that's periwinkle, Isam, the removed one. But these people refused to sell 150 on for me. I don't know why they did that. So I didn't get it. My list is 1,330 naira. Let's get cooking, guys. So we start off by preparing our ingredients. This is not a detailed tutorial, please. If you want a detailed video on how to make this soup where you're guided step by step, there are two videos I have on the channel showing you how to make a dikai So I'm going to put them in the cards so that you get a step by step guide there. Check them out. Pounding my pepper, crayfish, and the rest together when making soup. So that's what I put into this pot right now. I still can't believe I got palm oil for 150 naira. Really, I didn't know you could get into that though. I'm really happy I did this challenge. When you're on a budget, I think it's good to get ingredients that will impact a lot of flavor into the food that way when your food has a lot of flavor you will not miss the other ingredients that you couldn't buy guys these vegetables cost me just 300 naira still unbelievable especially if the water leaf it was so much for 100 i did not use all of it this challenge just goes to show that you don't need to break the bank to eat good food Especially as parents, sometimes we just fret that there's not enough money, there's not enough money. But with the little you have, you can actually whip up something for you and your family. My budget at the Kaikong is ready. This was more than enough to feed my family of six. We ate this and we still had some leftover soup. If you've not seen the video that inspired this one, please check out CME's channel. She made a delicious plantain porridge with some peppered gumbo. I encourage you to check out other videos in this challenge. That way you have ideas on how to make different things with a little amount of money. If you're new to the channel, you've not subscribed yet, please subscribe. And when you subscribe, don't forget to click on the notification bell and select the all option. So that whenever new videos are posted, you'll be one of the first to get them. Here is delicious soup. I made a bath and a pot of soup with less than a thousand five hundred naira. This is amazing. Thank you for seeing me for this challenge because it was a real eye opener. It was fun to make. It was really good. Thank you. <laughs> Here is the bath. I do not use all the gary. I almost forgot to show you this part. <laughs>
please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and share it with your friends and family and everyone you know <laughs> thank you very much for watching see you in the next video